first of all you will need to add the setting that allows changing the UI to the web config. You can do it in two ways. Either you can directly edit a web config of a site by adding the key enable sitemap switch UI or you can do it when you deploy an Acumatic instance using the deployment wizard as you can see on the screenshot here. Next, when you've enabled the UI change for the site, you can go to a sitemap and you can change UI for any screen that has both already implemented. Or at the same time, you can go to any specific screen and click Tools, switch to Modern UI, which will convert that screen to the modern UI if it already has the implementation. Just a note here, the modern UI is still in preview stage, so it is not for production use. But you can already take a look at the new UI and see what it looks like. If there is a screen that is not yet converted to the new UI, so some built-in screens are not yet converted, or you may have a custom screen that you've created and uh, you would like to convert it to the new UI. You can also do it in automatic mode. For that, first of all, you enable the sitemap switch as shown on the previous slide. And then you go to the screen, you go to customization, and you click convert to modern UI. Just a note for that, you will need the customizer role, and it is recommended to have all the features that may hide some parts of the screen to be enabled for that site. So when you've clicked the convert to modern UI, Acumatica tries to automatically convert the existing ASPX into TypeScript produce HTML, so from old UI to new UI. So you click that button, you get the zip archive back containing the TypeScript files and HTML file. You take those, you put those into the front-end sources folder of the site. Here you have the full path specified. And after that, you will need to build the front-end sources. You can do that by running npm run get modules command and then npm run build. If everything was successful, your screen now has the modern UI counterpart. So you can use tools, switch to modern UI button to convert it to the new look. It is not 100% ideal, so you may want to change things there, but it's a good start for you to start migrating your screens to the new UI. 